Like one of my friends said to me, say, you are diminished. I said, I'm not diminished. You are diminished. I said, I'm not. A friend of mine sent me a, a seed of one million naira, 1996. And I said, I want to see the letter. So, and he, he wrote there, for the work of the ministry. I said, for the work of the ministry. He said, but he wrote your name. I said, we didn't see the letter. They don't write letter on check now. He didn't know which one to write. We have too many names. So he wrote my name to put in a profit account. I signed it over to the church. One million. It was very important at that time. That time. It was very important. But God forbid that I eat what is not mine. No, it's important. I endorse it to church. God in heaven is sending me now. Praise God. And suddenly by error or default, they say this child is the wealthiest pastor on the earth. Yes, sir. And they are not lying, sir. They are not. Yes, sir. They are, not. They are far from lying. I'm super financially comfortable. Yes, sir. And I've been since I saw the light. <laughs> no, because I have something in my hand. Before I had anything in my hands, I was very comfortable. Living my size for time, yeah. enjoying the grace of God, yes. and staying up what is not mine. I, I have enjoyed my life, sir. And I want to enjoy your life much more. If you're interested, whatever we have taught here, it depends on your interest. Are you interested <laughs> to set a spiritual structure in place? Are you interested to mind administrative structure? Are you interested in setting financial structure? We have a financial management board that defines uh, what goes to what. We have a huge percentage of our income that goes into the ARC project for long. Since God stopped it, we are doing it. We don't know when he will say it. Can I hear your email? Amen. Amen. Efficient management is a miracle. <laughs> it provokes the supernatural. It provokes the supernatural. Can I take me said the Lord told him, depression is coming, and this is what to do, not to be a victim. Stop any outage I have not sent you, one. Keep social percentage of ministry income aside in reserve. So the pressure came, and the ministry could not feel nothing. Everything was just going normal. Normal, straight, impact. We have maintained a reserve account for years, years, years. It goes to that unspendable account until when a command comes from heaven to do something. <coughs> for years. <coughs> when he said build the faith tabernacle, we had quite some resources in our reserve account. Quite some big resources. Hmm? The, land was bought from the, the land was bought. The whole land was bought from the reserve. I mean, five hundred and thirty acres, and then no offering was taken for it. And we have hundreds of millions in that reserve account. Not knowing when it would tell us to start construction, but we have it's, it's a normal account. We have. Don't eat up everything. People even went as bad as taking offering for meetings. My God. For what? What is the church offering for? This meeting will cost us uh, 100 million. To do what? Eh? Uh, we are buying schedule. Who puts you behind? Don't you know how much money you have? People, games, games. The, the offerings in the church is for the operation of the church. So now start shouting, you bring offering, bring offering. They say, why? They say, we are doing convention. We are doing Shiloh. <laughs> Nobody has ever given a damn for Shiloh. That's right. In this ministry. Mm. Nobody. Let, let's be normal. Let's be normal. Let's be spiritual. <laughs> because all these games people are playing, they'll be out of when they say no time. 
out of ministry in no time. Many are out of. They are just existing in terms of uh, space. But for impact, it's not there. They are, they are, they are just existing in space. There, there is nothing to that ministry. And this is what happened. They are going to do the naming of a child, and the whole church has to be involved. To name a child. They gave back to the child. Amen. When we name our second son, we use Chin Chin. You know Chin Chin? <laughs> they don't use uh, uh, food to name it, they use mouth. a body is a body lifter. Yes, sir. A pastor is a body lifter, not a body to the people. We are doing marriage anniversary. You can do uh, post-marriage anniversary. Is that the church concern? No. No. I know you still like me. <laughs> Praise the Lord. When my old man passed on, I said, um, anybody who brings any church vehicle has committed sin. You are not permitted. Okay, for what? Was he a pastor? No. <laughs> Amen. Don't do say anything. Huh? You know, you hit everything on people. Yeah. To do what? We are living here with a renewed approach Amen. to our finances and the finances of the church. You need your own account. You need your own annual report. Yes. You need to have your own budget. Yes. They are all serious matters. Yes, they are all serious matters. Well, they need bread. They are looking after you. They are looking for you in the house. They say the man of God has gone out. <laughs> Children say we must eat. They say well, you have to wait for him. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm glad God said we made this a seminar and it's doing that. Everybody's going into next levels. Amen. My concern is that your future is so enviable. Amen. If only you can see it. You will give it all it takes. If God can't trust you, he can't entrust his wealth in your hand. If God can't trust you, he cannot entrust his wealth in your hand. If God can't trust you, he cannot entrust 